then boom, your fuel injectors are clean. What's up guys? Alright, today I'm going to show you how to clean some fuel injectors. Because I got them out, so I might as well clean them. What you will need is some carb cleaner, a 9 volt battery. I've seen it done with a double A, but I tried it and mine doesn't work with a double A, so I need a 9 volt. And just some speaker wire with the uh, ends on it to clamp onto the inside of the fuel injector. So you clamp those on there. And then once you get that in, and you touch the other end of the cable to the battery, you'll hear the click noise for when it activates. And then when you spray the carb cleaner inside of there, and you touch the battery, it'll spray the carb cleaner through it. Now, in order to get the fluid into the fuel injector, you just take a valve stem, Take the end off of it. You got to take the core from the middle out. They sell a tool that you can do that. I already did it, so I can't really show you how to do it, but they make a tool to get this out. It unscrews. And you put it on the end here, but you got to take this little o ring off first. So you just take the o ring off. And then this goes around the end of that, around the end of the fuel injector. Like so. And then I would suggest wrapping some tape around there just to be safe so this doesn't pop off on you. Then you take the valve stem cap and you drill a hole in it. Just with a drill bit. About the size of the straw so that way the straw can go through it. But you don't want it too big because you want the straw to be snug. So, there you go, the straw's through it. And then you put that on there. Put your straw through. And you have now made a pressurized system. So then you squirt this while you activate the fuel injector, and it'll squirt through. And I'll show you what that looks like. Tape it on there. And then I got this sweet little vice grip right here, which is also going to help hold that valve stem on there. Put the carb cleaner in the hole. And watch the magic. Kind of tricky. Ready? You want to just give it a nice pulse. And that's how you do it. So, just do that to all four of them, or six, or eight, or however many you got, and that's it. Thanks for watching this episode of Mills Garage. Make sure to like and comment below, share the video, and we'll see you next time.